Do you want to sound smarter and more professional at your work? If yes, then this video is for you. Hi guys, here I am again to help you how you can modernize your secure CRT tool to work like a pro with the smart tricks. If you are struggling to find the solution everywhere, then this video walks you through exactly what you need to do. So you can apply these changes on your secure CRT tool and work like a pro at your work. Okay, so let's get started. So let's first change the boring text background and change the text appearance to become more communicative. So for that, you need to click on option here and go to the global options. Now select the option default session and then click on edit default settings. Select the option appearance. And here you have multiple color schemes. So the current color scheme or the default color scheme is monochrome. And apart from this, you can have a variety of color scheme which you can apply according to your preference. So here you can see multiple color schemes. Let me choose one of them and apply it to my secure CRT tool and we'll see the result. And how you can do this, just select the preferred color scheme and click the OK button. So I'm going to select black and blue or yellow and black. So here you have a preview window and you can see the color scheme that you have selected. So according to my color scheme, it has black background and yellow color text. Okay, let me click OK. Change all session and then click OK. Now you have to restart your secure CRT tool. So I'm going to close this one and we'll open it again. And let me connect to the device. See, it has changed the color scheme for me. Now the background is black and the font is yellow. Now if you wish to change the color scheme for the current session, so you have to click here on this icon and you have to follow almost the same path. So click on appearance and then you will have multiple color schemes or the same color schemes available. So this time I'm going to select white and blue and then I can press the OK button and as soon as you press the OK button it will get change the color scheme for you. So with this smart trick, you can change the color scheme for the secure CRT tool. Okay, one more thing I want to tell you, do not confuse with the color scheme and the color theme. The color theme is applicable for entire secure CRT interface. And the color scheme is only applicable for the user interface, which has just now experienced. Let me show you how you can change the color theme for the secure CRT. So for that, you need to click on view and you have option here color theme. And right now the default color theme is native and you can choose according to your preference. So we have carbon, VS 2013 blue, dark, office 2013, office 10 blue, office 10 black, office 10 silver. And we have some legacy color themes also. So let me select VS 2013 view. Now with this method, you can change the entire color theme. So hope you are aware what is color theme and what is color scheme. Let me roll back the color theme. So I'm going to choose native. Now let's assume after a week or some time later, you got bored with the color scheme and want to change the color scheme again. So I'm talking about the session interface or the user interface. The other option is you can follow me and create a button on the secure CRT bar. So I'm talking about here. Right now you can see three buttons which has some commands map under the button. And using the button, you can change the color theme anytime. So for that, you need a Python file which can help you to switch the color theme anytime. 
If you don't have this file, there is a link in the description and you can download the file from there. Once the script is finished downloading, you can map a button on the secure CRT bar to run the script. So let's create a button. So for that, you need to click on the secure CRT button bar and click on new button. So what type of function it should be since we are going to execute the script. So I will select run script. I need to locate the or browse the script. So for me, I have downloaded the script under IOL image folder and the color scheme name is color scheme auto rotation dot py. Click OK. You can type any desired name. So I'm going to type here switch color scheme. Also, I want this button to be different from the existing one. So I'm going to choose purple color and click OK. There you have it. Click the button to change the next available color scheme. So let me click on this button and you will see the color scheme has been automatically changed. Now let me click one more time and it has changed again. As you click the button to run the script again and again, the color scheme name will appear in the status bar. So here, right now I have a black and yellow color scheme. So you can see that the name of this color scheme yellow and black. If I go and change the color scheme again, you will see that the color scheme has been changed and the name has been reflected here, traditional. All right, we understood how we can change the color theme as well as the color scheme. But I want this text appearance to be more engaging. For example, if something is down or inactive, the text appearance should be red. And if something is up or active, the text appearance should be red or any other color. Also, the device host name should appear in different color. Let me go back and restore entire settings. So option, global options, default session, edit default settings. And I'm going to choose the default color scheme, which is monochrome. And we'll apply the settings for all sessions. I need to close the secure CRT and reopen it, and reopen it again. Now let's connect the device. So at present, I'm connected to a Cisco switch. I have set up buttons and the secure CRT buttons bar here to facilitate running commands easily. For example, if I want to see the interface status and the IP of the interface, I can go and click this button, show IP interface, and it will execute the command for me. And now if I want to see the interface status, along with the description then i can go and execute the command show interface status and you can see the interface name description status vlan id and some hardware settings so my initial goal is to color the keyword up in green and down in red wherever they appear on the screen to get started with keyword highlighting click on the setting so i need to follow the same global option then default session click on edit default settings now go to the appearance option and here you have highlight keywords so as of now i'm not using any keyword list you can see it's none and to create a new you need to click on new so let me create a new list here and i will call it cisco now I want the keyword up to be displayed in green color. For that, I will use regular expression under the keyword section. So let me create a regular expression for this one. Dot and then a strict and the keyword is up. And I need to tell the secure CRT that this is not a keyword, it is a regular expression which will recognize the keyword up from the output and display in green color okay let me add this one 
and I need to select the color for this one. So which color I want to choose it? It's green color. And then you have to click OK and then OK. Apply to all and then click OK. So I need to close the secure CRT and we'll open it again. Let's connect to the device and execute the command show IP interface brief. See, as soon as you execute the command, the keyword up displayed in green color. The another task is I want the keyword down to be displayed in red color. So let's finish this task also. So this time I'm going to choose the shortcut option. So click on setting session option, click on appearance, click edit. And now I want the keyword down to be displayed in red color. So this is a regular expression. Click on add. So right now it is in red color. That's fine. Click OK. Close the session properties and you will see it has changed the color for the down keyword. So this time let's handle the prompt keyword with greater than symbol followed by hash symbol. Also I will handle the sub interface keyword with a hash symbol. For all of them I will follow the same procedure to add the keyword in the existing list. So let's do this. Click on this gear icon, edit the existing list. The pattern I'll use is a sequence of anything but a greater than sign, one or more, and followed by the greater than sign. So for that, follow the keyword which I'm using here. I will enable the keyword as a regular expression and press the add button to add this keyword into the list. Now it has a red color so I want this color to be changed to this color and then close the property by click on OK button and then again click on OK button. So let's verify whether the color of the prompt has been changed. So let's go and use the command exit. See it has changed the color. And let's use the command enable and now it has the black color. So I want this time to change the color for this prompt. So for that I need to follow the same method. Click on this gear icon and then click on appearance. I need to edit the list of Cisco. So basically I will use the same pattern but this time I am using hash symbol. So let's click here so that it can consider as a regular expression. Add this keyword under the list and will change the color to purple. Sorry pink. Click OK to close the properties and click here. See, it has changed the color for the prompt. Now let's execute the command conf t. See, it has maintained the same color as soon as I execute the command configure terminal. If you want to change the color for this prompt, follow me to use this keyword in your secure CIT tool. So click here, then edit the setting. Now this time, it should be almost same. Then followed by open parentheses and under the bracket it should be anything. Plus or hash shine. So let's add this one and we'll set the color for this one. So this time I'm going to choose orange don't forget to change its position and keep it on top so let me do this select this one and then click here 
to change its position click ok and then ok did i change the color for this one let me see yes i have changed sorry i forgot to check mark here because it has to be considered as a keyword as a regular expression now save it click ok then ok see it has changed the color for the configuration terminal code this is how you can make the screen more engaging and communicative you can easily guess the status of any keyword and make the decision but here is a catch not everyone has a good command on regular expression and not have good knowledge of scripting so now my next goal is to have all these activities done by the scripting for that the secure crt provides a file that you can import in the secure crt and this will surely solve all your problems if you don't have this file there is a link in the description and you can download the file from there once the script is finished downloading you can follow me and store the file in the specific locations so let me first delete the existing settings So let's import the file in secure CRT. So click option, go to the global option, click on configuration path, and then copy this path. Open in the folder browser. So I think I don't have anything here. Just close this one. It has been created just because we created Cisco list. now i need to find out the file so the so file is located in the download folder under iol and here you have a folder keywords copy this keyword folder and paste it here so what you will have under the keyword folder the cisco words as well as lab highlights close it and then close it this one also i open this now open the secure crt again connect to the device okay so it has not yet changed so go to the option select the global option select the option default session add the default settings click on appearance and now you have to select the list so i have cisco words and click OK. Apply this changes to all sessions. Click OK. So let me see if the changes has been reflected. Not yet. Close the secure CRT and open it again. Connect to the box again. See, it has changed the entire view of the user interface. You can see the difference between the tax appearance before and after. Along with this, you can change the theme which will make the secure CRT appearance more attractive. The thing we were doing manually one by one on secure CRT to highlight the keyword. The same settings has been applied by the script on the secure CRT. That's it guys. I hope you enjoyed the video and learned something new from this video. Let me know in the comment box if I explained the topic well or did I make any mistake. I hope we will meet again here and learn something new. I will see you in the next video. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.